Hey guys, this is Abhishek and in this video I will show you a quick way about how you can filter the data frame based on some specific values in a column. So sometimes you have a requirement that your call your data frame column contains some categorical data list of values maybe 10, 3, 15, whatever maybe the number of values and you want to filter that values filter the data frame based on that values for your specific requirement and how how you can do it efficiently so for that what i can do is uh, first of all uh, to import the from import pandas as pd import pandas as pd to import a data frame because i want to import a csv file the iris file just to show you a quick example so what I'll do is iris pd dot read underscore csv and I will just give a path uh, to the location where it is iris dot csv and I will simply write iris dot head hopefully this should yeah it works all right so here we have different columns but this is a uh, not so useful column so what i'll do is uh, i will just say iris dot drop and the column name as you can see labels so what i'll do is i will just uh, copy this um, paste it here and i will write in place is equals to true uh, okay i need to specify the access it's to one so one basically indicates that uh, it's a column all right now let's see so now the column has been removed and we have a good data set and my requirement is that i want to basically you know filter out the data based on some species that we have so if i want to know all of the species which are here then what i can do is iris dot uh, species dot or i can simply write instead of writing iris dot column so there are multiple ways if i write iris dot columns here are my iris dot columns what i was about to do earlier was iris dot species dot unique okay yeah u n i q u e so this is basically uh, iris.columns, just the column values in case there are a lot of columns and maybe species or something, some column is pretty, you know, far ahead. So that's how you can get the value. And second thing is uh, getting the values from the uh, unique values from the column. So this is the unique value. So what I can write is iris underscore data underscore list is equals to and I can simply write that I need these two values from my data frame. Okay. And now I can, what I can do is iris underscore SV that indicates Setosa versicle or what I can write is iris. And then again, iris dot columns dot is in. And then again, the iris underscore data underscore list. All right, it gives an error, uh, item wrong length 5 in the state of 150. All right, so I think the issue is that I just need to write species because we are looking under the species, not simply the column. Okay, iris underscore sv dot let's go ahead and print the entire thing so we got setosa and down there you will see only the words color even if you want what we can do is iris underscore sv dot species dot unique and you can confirm that it is just the setosa words color the next thing what you can do is uh, let's say you do not want these two values in your resulting data frame for your analysis. So simply add tilde over here. This particular expression will going to make sure that you are not getting these two values. All right, so let's go ahead and execute that. And let's go ahead and see. So now you only get Virginica, 
but not the Satoshi and Versicolor. So that's pretty much all very quickly I wanted to show you how you can really uh, make use of this is in function uh, that is that is available in products for filtering the data set.